Um, it's a big step up for me, and I feel like um, my teammates have a lot of confidence in me and always have my back and telling me to attack when I can and look to score and just do what I know how to do, do what I know what to do in the game. And I feel like that's helped me a lot. And the coaches have also had a lot of confidence in me. So just being able to build off of that in the game and just whether it's facilitating, defending, rebounding, or getting shots from my teammates, that's what I'm trying to do. You know, you guys, you know, not just Malia, but pretty much everybody, you know, especially the guards that really make kind of an effort to kind of attack the basket, get into the lane. Um, you know, you included driving, scoring, get, trying to get to the basket. You know, was that something that you saw that maybe you guys thought you could take advantage of coming into this game? Or, you know, what kind of led to that, do you think? Oh, most definitely. I feel like we all kind of developed the idea that if our shots, if our three-point shots aren't falling, what else can we do to score? What else can we do to help offensively? And obviously driving, we all are starting to drive now if our three-point shot isn't falling. And I feel like that's helped us a lot. And again, just building that confidence. So once we are driving and scoring off of that, then they'll maybe play up on us and we can create more off of that. Yeah, you were cracking the boards a lot tonight. I mean, was that something you wanted to do? You know, you talked you talk about low, how should we break that low? And then you put about a couple in one of them. Was that the key? Yeah, it was definitely the key. Um, the first half, it didn't look the best on my side. And I, um, my teammates kept getting on me, like telling me, you know what you need to do defensively, whether it's getting rebounds and defending. And to the second half, when we were talking in the locker room, they're saying like, they need more from me. And I took that, and I did that in the second half. It's been great seasons for both you here at Youngstown State and your sister at Ohio State, the Buckeyes are having a great season this season. Are you guys able to watch each other's games and kind of talk about that and you play it a lot at the same time? Yeah, so actually this morning I FaceTimed my sister and we were just talking about basketball and, I, and she said she's going to watch my game. And so just being able to talk to her about that and text her after her games and just saying, how can we like be better? Like, what did we do wrong? What can we do differently? And just being able to have that to communicate with her is really nice. You played the most kids today out of everyone on the team. What's it like having a coach that love you to be on the floor and I mean, it's nice, and I love how like my teammates and my coaches have that confidence in me to be able to play those minutes and be able to contribute. But I also love it for my teammates as well. Yeah, it's been a long time since you guys won a you know a game on the road. You go on the road now for three. Just how important is it to try to get that you know winning streak back on the road? I mean, we're still hungry, and we're not going to we're not going to back down. We're going to keep fighting till the end, and just taking the momentum from this game and bringing it on the road. We, we want to get two wins on the way on the way back.